<laughs> really? This is it? Place. Yes, right. What's up? All well, right. One play. What is going on, everybody? How are y'all doing? What's up everybody coming, watching the video? Give the video a thumbs up. Let's get it over 300 likes. The first news item, we have a couple of dope news items for this video, but the first one is a doozy. We've been calling the next iteration of the Switch naturally the switch pro because sony the playstation 4 they had a playstation 4 pro and so we naturally just started calling it the pro but bro it's not the pro <coughs> according to this one journalist and he's not the only one but on twitter journalists this is coming from comicbookgaming.com or comic comicbook.com a a journalist who goes by the name PH Brazil um, recently suggested that the next Switch revision will not be called the Nintendo Switch Pro, but rather the Super Switch. Y'all remember the Nintendo, the NES, and what did Nintendo do? Turned it into a Super Nintendo. We went from the Nintendo entertainment system to the super nintendo entertainment system so he's saying that that's what nintendo is going to do with the switch just add super to the front of it now he isn't the only one um last year an insider that goes by the name of tyler mcvicker also referred to the next model as the super switch now, Nintendo, when it comes to their consoles, very unpredictable. With Sony, we know, PlayStation 1, the next gen PlayStation system, calling it right now, is going to be called the PlayStation 6. Sony's been very predictable. Xbox, sort of like Nintendo, except much worse with their naming choices. But Nintendo, just so random with their names. We went from the um, 3DS to the new 3ds why call the next iteration or iterative upgrade just new that's so confusing when you get to the store what if you wanted the old 3ds but it's a brand new console so you say you want i want a new 3ds the game stop employees like so you want the new 3ds or the old 3ds but uh, they have used super in the past uh, for example just mario the original, original Mario Brothers, where it's just one screen, was just called Mario Brothers. And then on the NES, they called it Super Mario Brothers. <laughs> NES console to Super NES. And so, Super Switch, not bad. But it's not quite feature-proof. After the Super Switch, what you're going to call the next upgrade or the next thing. So, Super Switch. Super Switch, according to this leaker, I want to know, what do you guys think about this name choice all right next news item a pretty dope game cool game balen wonder world the demo a demo is out now um on the nintendo switch the game uh square enix just launched this um a demo available so if you're on the edge of getting the game you still have time to test it out <coughs> the game comes out march at the end of march isn't that when monster hunter rise comes out r.i.p balen for me but the demo is available now and you get to in the demo explore three of the game's worlds world one which features acts one two and a boss and also world four um 
um, in the game. So <coughs> no harm, no foul to check out the demo. Try it out. The game does look cool. My thing is, it's a 3D platformer. Here's the thing though, man. I'm not touching any 3D platformers until Mario 3D World drops. And so, um, go and check that out. Next news item. This one is pretty insane. Check out these numbers. The latest Famitsu sale numbers have been revealed for the week. This is just one week numbers in Japan for the weeks of January 18th through January 24th. And as you can see in Japan, Nintendo is dominating. The Switch consoles combined sold over 100,000 in one week in arguably the slowest month of the year. Compare that to the brand new PlayStation 5 only 15,000 and you can say oh supply constraints that's why sony console is not selling good look at the ps4 3,000 um ps5 digital edition 2000 um the d um the ds is um the 3ds is still selling bro check out those xbox sales bro 386 xbox series 38 ps4 pro 16 and so nintendo is dominating in the land of the rising sun this is partly why i'm skeptical of a switch pro coming in 2021 nintendo has no reason to switch sales are still killing it um so those are the switch sales numbers for the last week in japan and nintendo's just dominating the market next news item this one is pretty lit tons of new information about mario 3d world browsers furies just dropped on the internet now we got some more tidbits on the game because outlets have gotten um preview copies early copies of the game information galore has been on the internet and check this out games beat says it took three hours to beat F bowser's fury and so bowser's fury the new world he's saying <coughs> it takes about three hours to beat another three hours to unlock all 100 cat shine so if you want a 100 percent bowser's fury it's gonna run you about six hours which is perfect i'll probably do that all right uh, additionally bowser's fury takes place in one giant world Within that large seamless world exists smaller subsections, which are like individual stages. They just all exist in the same open space, many of them as islands in a big lake. Each of these areas hosts a handful of unlockable cat shines. You can earn each of them by completing an objective. All right. Um, uh, you, you'll find even more cat shines hidden in the water areas between the stages. All right can't hurt fury bowser unless you've collected enough sh cat shines to turn into a giant giga mario otherwise you'll have to dodge his attacks all right you can use a switch's touch screen or if you're playing on your tv a controller's gyro controls to point and click bowser jr towards power-ups i'm glad that nintendo as much as i like on um, the ps5 not too many developers are taking well um in the past have taken advantage of gyro on the sony's platform but it seems like all of nintendo's games they use it i love it all right all right using bowser on the amiibo nfc point will immediately wake fury bowser from his slumber whoa <coughs> where's my bowser i have a couple of bowsers i have a, um my here here it is right here let me see. Nah, i can't stand up Wait, I can't stand up. Check this out. So if I put this back on um, my Amiibo, it wakes Bowser up automatically. You could use Amiibo in the game. That's lit. All Bowser Amiibo have the same functionality. All right. So a couple more tidbits on the game. All right. Those are the news items for this video. We have one more. Why do I have Tom Nook? Or is that one of the Nook kids? I forget their names. Tim, Tom, Tim, Tom. 
just to remind the animal crossing new horizon update is out um now yesterday when i was on the game the game updated boom an explosion of a peacock dancing might greet you um and a festival will be on the 15th that's going to be on the 15th but glad to see that they're continuing to update this game this game was nintendo's cash cow for 2020 incredible unrealistic sale numbers this game was single-handedly carried the switch through the pandemic all right dudes what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video um i'm a little congested sound off in the comment section below i want to know but before you go bro click that subscribe button stay up to date wait hold on my kids coming in hold on let me get them coming you don't have on a shirt man all right whatever come on <laughs> sound off in the comment section below I want to know, but, but before, before you go, go bro, bro, click that, that subscribe button. button. Stay up to date. All things Nintendo. We out. Peace. You still watching this video? That means you like me. You really like me. I got to hook you up. That's right. I'm giving away a $60 digital code every month for your platform of choice. Xbox, Nintendo, or PlayStation. Two ways to enter. One, make sure you're subscribed to this fire right here on YouTube. Two, follow me on Twitter at Obi-Wan Plays. And that's it. You're in for the giveaway. But wait. There's more. Do you want to join an awesome gaming discord with prizes and tournaments? Do you want to get on my friend list and game with your boy? Become a sponsor. Three ways to join. One, subscribe on Twitch. If you have Twitch Prime, you can do it for free. Two, click the join button right here on YouTube and become a member. And the third way to join, patreon.com backslash obi one plays. You'll thank me later. Also, check out the swag, bro. Links are in the description. I'll see you later.